Greetings and welcome to today's episode of Life More Smart. I'm your host, Brian Pruitt. If you haven't already done so, press that subscribe button so you'll never miss another podcast. Now for today's episode. Today I'd like to share a story of Dr. Emoto. The doctor did most of his experiments with water, but one of his first experiments was very fascinating. He placed regular water into a Petri dish, and then he would have the students gather around, and then he asked them to speak negative energy into the room. They would say things like, I hate you, you're stupid, you're an ugly person, on and on and on. They then took these dishes of water and froze them. After it was frozen, they brought these dishes back out and put them underneath a microscope. And what they saw surprised everyone. They saw all of these small, ugly, black blobs. Blobs that looked like small, black, frozen peaks on a mountain. They then took the very same type of water. Water that came from the very same source. They did everything in the same sequence. The water went into the Petri dish, but this time they decided to send positive energy into the room. They would say things like, you're beautiful. You're so smart. Everyone loves you. You are going to be a success. On and on and on. Then they froze the dishes. This time, when they brought the dishes out and placed them under the microscope, they saw something that nearly startled them. They saw beautiful snowflakes. Snowflakes that were stunning, white, beautiful. They were fascinated by this experiment. They concluded that this experiment proved that water has memory. And if you remember from your school years, your body is made up of approximately 85% water. Your brain is made up of even more. So when you say negative things to yourself, you are truly affecting yourself and the outcome of your success in a very real way. Our thoughts, our words, and our feelings, they all carry enormous amounts of energy. So it is vitally important to avoid negative self-talk. You see, the negative chatter does nothing but hinder our success. Watch your words. Well, that's it for today, everyone. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make his face shine on you and be gracious to you. May the Lord turn his face toward you and give you peace. Well, if you've enjoyed this podcast... Don't forget to share it with a friend and those loved ones around you. And until next time, have a successful day.